In today's culture, the idea of leaving a legacy is often tied to physical assets. How much money will I leave my family? Is my will prepared? How's my estate? Who will get my property? But deep in the heart of a woman who seeks the God of the Bible lies an unshakable truth. Driven by love, she holds a standard high for all eyes to see a desire to pass on the best of life to the next generation. These women take the passing of ancient truth personally, because for them, it is all personal. As women, we're fighting for our children to have prayer lives that are meaningful, messages that are hopeful, hearts that are full of forgiveness and lasting relationships with the Savior, Jesus. On May 7th, we'll get a reminder of why these things are worth fighting for. Then, on May 14th, Mother's Day, Kids of Faith are putting together an incredible hospitality table, and each woman will be given a gift. We'll also be making a donation to the Baby Ready Infant Mortality Program at the Wesley Center for every woman. In the sermon that day, called Leaving a Legacy, we'll discuss how God uses our lives to impact the next generation. And on May 15th, all women will have the opportunity to put those words into practice as we hold our first ever women's leadership dinner from 6 to 8 on Monday, May 15th. For many young ladies, the opportunity to start a new path is just around the corner. This can be both exciting and a little terrifying. At this dinner, they'll have the opportunity to hear from women who are successful leaders in their fields. This will also be a perfect opportunity for older women to invest in younger women who they can share this experience with. We hope to see women of all ages at the Women's Leadership Dinner from 6 to 8 on May 15th. Sign up at the Missions and Ministries wall in the gathering area or online at tipcitygmc.org forward slash info by May 10th. With so many possibilities, we can't wait to see how God will move during the A Life of Legacy sermon series. And we can't wait to share it with you.